Hey train fans, hope you're having a great day. Welcome back to the channel. My name's Chris. Thank you for joining us. Behind me here is a water tower I got at the recent New Braunfels, Texas train show. And so I wanted to go ahead and now take it out of the box, check it out closer, and find a home for it on the layout. So without ado, let's give it a look. So the New Braunfels Railroad Museum uh, hosted the show uh, recently. And uh, they had a few tables set up where their members had uh, various items uh, for sale. A lot of it was in HO and some other gauges. But they had a little back table with some old, uh, mostly post-war, uh, O-gauge material. But in the back corner of the table, I saw this water tower. And I've really been meaning to get some kind of water tower to go with all my Strasburg items. Because uh, I always see at the Strasburg Railroad a uh, nice prominent water tower. Uh, it's uh, unmarked as far as I can tell. It's been quite a while since I've physically been there and don't recall if it had any lettering on it. But I uh, thought this would be a fairly good substitute. Very high quality Rail King operating water tower here. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. As you can see from the sticker it was 50 bucks. Here's the uh, label here operating O scale water tower. So while the box looks a little uh, abused, it's not too bad, but the piece appeared to be in really good shape, so let's find out. That looks cool. Thank you, Chloe. Is it heavy? That's plastic. It's not that heavy. Oh, okay. Is there real water with that or no? No, no water. Okay. It looks beautiful. I like the wood color. Yeah, no, thank you, sweetie. Well, a little, a little dusty. I like the chains. They're cool. Yeah. What are the chains made of? I don't know. It's so big. Yeah, then some dust and some hair. <laughs> from Luna. No, not from our doggy. <laughs> Looks to be in a very good condition. Yeah, it probably is your hair. And the contacts looked looked brand new here, never even used as far as I can tell. They just sat on static display. Ooh. I think we'll get this wiped down, cleaned up a bit. Well, my assistant helped uh, get some of the dust off with a damp paper towel. We went ahead and reattached the chains to the little hook that's down here. So all in all, I think it's in great shape. This was listed in the 2000 Volume 2 catalog from MTH and released the same year. Had a original MSRP of $99.95. So it looks pretty sharp. And to take a look at the interior wiring, there is a motor inside. If you uh, wire up the water tower, you can have the spout drop on command. Yeah, very happy with it. Still has the original uh, warranty card and some of the, the wiring and everything. So now I just got to find a good spot for it. Let's take a look here. Okay, here we have it on the back corner of the layout. Hopefully there's enough clearance between the tracks and our little chain here that 
no locomotive will snag on it. At least with these wood sided passenger cars, there's plenty of space. But I gotta say, I'm very happy with the water tower. Uh, looks great and uh, is a nice complement to some of our other layout pieces. Like we have our uh, Strasburg J Tower, the Switch Tower, our passenger station here. Of course, we have the East Strasburg Passenger Station and uh, our other items here, uh, Restaurant Row, <laughs> a few cars, not too many. We got our local news outlet, but uh, that's a good height to it, so nice backdrop. Very happy with the purchase, glad to have it, so been wanting to have a water tower on the layout, so I can finally uh, check that box <laughs> off the list. So there we have it. Okay, well, thank you to my assistant and thank you for checking out the video. Please do like, subscribe, and check out our other videos. Hope you have a great day. Take care. My name's Chloe. I'm six years old and I'm in first grade. And my dad is gonna, um, is gonna see you, um, film this to you. I'm gonna say it's quietly and that tradition you remember. It was 50 bucks. And that's all. Bye bye. Now, um, we have cleaned the, this. Now we can finally do the video. It's gonna be very fun. We cleaned the roof and the bottom. I don't know which mostly was, um, the dirtiest, but I think it was this part. And, um, this, um, thing can, can easily break in this one and this one. But I, I don't know at the bottom and, and this can break easily, but I wonder what is this. It's at an inch thick. I'm going to show you inside. It's just some wires and like black stuff. It's heavy too. And this thing is made out of plastic. So you have to be very careful. Um, it's hard to see the dust on the bottom because um it, it's hard to see dust because um this is gray. And these are the instructions. And these are wires for, um, I think, to like turn it on. And then it may make water sounds. This is the roof. Inside, it's just like fluffing. Well, there's some stuff, but like inside. This is the inside with those little two holes. Like. And then. We have this right here, right here, right here, and then we have the ladder right here to like um, it goes um right here, 
It goes right here. It says so like well when so, so like when this finish um it gets one more ladder salary so you can climb up all the way. And this doesn't open. And this is a chain, it's pretty long too. And then if you close it, it looks like this, but it's kind of like off balance. And this is a meter layer. It tells you how much water is inside. Like if there's like water to like this shape, that means it'll be four um, milliliters. If it was all the way right here, that'd be nine milliliters. If it was all the way right here, it'd be 10 milliliters. If it was all the way here, that'd be one milliliter. I thought 10 was the highest and one was the lowest. But I guess it could be switched and like opposite. And this is like where the water comes out right here. And these are the ones that stables it up. And, and, and this is what, this is what, this is what, this is what. I don't know what this And this is plastic. The roof is wood as well. It's sides wood, but not inside that. Not inside this. Um, there's there's like, like wires. Um, the wires are red and black. And and the like on the sides, uh, there's there's more wood. So. I'm not sure if, if it's in perfect place for us to record. And I wonder what's um, inside this middle. Well, I think um, it, it like closes like at the top. So probably that staples it as well. These chains are really cool. When I um, do this, it's like really satisfying for me. This chain right here, um, if you pull it, this thing will go down and down until water falls out. And then, the, the bottom is something, but it's definitely not wood, but it can be colored wood. Well, I think it's stone or steel or iron. This could be stone or steel or iron. Well, do you know that um stone, not stone, um, iron can't stick to magnets? Magnets can be in like any shape. Well, I don't know what what these are made of. And we're done. Well, the speaker is actually setting, so if I click on it, 
on a go to, go to settings. So here is the setting app. Here's the setting app. Let's do the real speaker. That's the speaker. Here's the app. Let's do the bell. It's like the last time where um I clicked it and like I I I I had to click it again to like turn it on. This, this is the same thing. And then let's do the the final one. This one. Right here. Wait. How many times do you want me to do it? Let's do it all the way to ten. First, let's, let's do like one click. Now let's do two clicks. Now let's do three. We're oh my, we're so close to five. Now let's do four. One more to five. Now let's do five. Five more left. Now let's do like the whole thing. Wait, how many seconds? Well, I, I think time. The ten seconds are up. That was great. Now the last time I, I'm going to do what everybody does. This is going so great and so fun! Should we turn it a little bit lower or faster? I don't know. Let's do lower. Is this enough? I think it's too slow. That's enough. I think it could be a little bit faster, but now let's go to the fastest. Well, not the like high, but the different like small um tracks are like I can't go like that fast. That's enough. Here's the app, the one right here, where we go all the way to the top and go like super speed, but I think it'll follow the tracks because there's like slight turns. Um you, you go all the way and, and it's just like all straight. I didn't remember the bell was on. I'm sorry that this, this was annoying you. Dispatcher, you got any more railroad for us? Over. Roger, your track is clear. Dispatcher out. It's so fun to play. Now you do it. <laughs> The bell. I like when it goes ding ding ding. You know you you make train sounds. Um, make train sounds is easy. You just have to put C H and then put it together, and so that makes a. Ch 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 ch. I start with C H. My daddy starts with C H. We both have. It's like we have the same name, but it's not. The first name is this one, but, 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 but we are the Bachmans. My mama is the Montagnons. Dispatcher, are we clear through the dock? 
Diamond, over. That's affirmative. Your track is clear. Out. We're done. Now my dad is going to do the rest. I'll put the app right here. I'm going to make it perfect. Well, my assistant uh, helped get some of the dust off of the water tower. Went ahead and uh, reattached the chains to the little hook that's down here. So, yeah, it looks to be in uh, great shape. This was in the 2000 Volume 2 catalog of MTH, uh, Rail King. That's crazy. Chloe, do I need the commentary on everything I say?